Hi everyone, welcome to 30 Something Beauty. My name is Cassandra Thompson and I am your beauty loving 30 something making videos here on YouTube for other 30 something. So welcome if this is your first time. Uh, if you like what you see, be sure to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up, hit the notification bell so you know when new videos are coming out. And with that, we'll get started. So today is all about my favorites for February. Uh, and I have a couple of different areas to show you. Some makeup stuff, but also some other just, I'm pointing here because they're over here. Some other life things that I just want to share with y'all. So we're going to get started first. Like, I just jump right in. We're going to get started first with these Morphe brushes. So a Morphe store just opened in my mall right around Christmas. And, you know, I had my no by January, so I wouldn't let myself go in the store. But I finally went in, and you guys, this brush set is life-changing, and it costs $17. That's right, $17. It's crazy. Um, I am loving it because it's all pretty, and my mom's calling me. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. It's all pretty densely packed. Um, I did just watch them wash them. So this one's still a little damp, so I can't show you, but I use this with powder for contour now, and it like puts it on in the nicest way and then pulls up. I use these two to blend cream contour around the nose and little detail areas. Um, this one I have used to blend out cream products, but I have also switched over and used it for like the dim light setting powder. They're just, they're, they're so good. $17. That's it. Putting them back before I make a mess. Focus. Now with that, I also got the contour set at Morphe. And I am loving it. This is Face Palette 9C Highlight Contour. I like it because sometimes I want just a light color that's not shimmery uh, for my highlight. And then this color has been great for contour for me. I'm not wearing it today. But it's been great for contour for me because some of the stuff I own has just been too dark. Um, but this too, I don't remember how much it was. Probably like 15 Super affordable, ridiculously affordable, and I'm really, it's fun to play with. I'm liking it. Last thing I got while in the Morphe store, I broke down and did it. I got the shadow shields to go under the eye. Once again, didn't use them today. Um, they're a little pricey. You get 30 shields, so that's roughly 15 uses. Uh, it's $10, so it's a lot, but... I did reuse them. Like they stay sticky for a while. So I used it again the next day and it just worked better than the tape. It hits the way the eye goes a lot better, a lot nicer. Um, so I really, I enjoyed using these. I think they're worth a shot. I don't, as you can see, I didn't use it today. I don't use them every day, but for special occasions where you want to get it right, I think it's worth it. Okay. Two products that were kind of all over YouTube and I didn't talk about them yet. The Becca Anti-Fatigue Under Eye Primer. Now, some people keep saying, I don't feel the cooling sensation. Where's the cooling sensation? To that I say, where did it say this would be cooling? Like, I get that it's blue. <laughs> it's not cooling. It just says anti-fatigue. Doesn't say cooling. Um... It's a deceptive product. I think if you watch some other folks' videos on this, you'll see that they, they wipe their hand in it and then put it under their eye and went, I don't feel anything. I don't see anything. And it's true. Like, you kind of are rubbing your finger in it going like, is, is anything coming off on my finger? Is anything going under my eye? Is this working? <clears throat> and then you put your concealer on or your foundation, you go, oh, oh yeah, it's working. Um, it's there. It's just filling in very nicely and setting in. And so you're not going to see it until you put something over it. But I'm really liking it. It's pricey. It's $32, but I think it'll last me a long time. 
Then, the other thing I have in my hand, in case, in case you missed it, uh, Makeup Revolution came up with a concealer that's supposed to be a Tarte Shape Tape dupe, and since Tarte Shape Tape makes me break out, I wanted to try it. It is so good. Um, I'm in love. I think I'm going to go buy another one just so I can keep one in my purse at all times. I like this more than my Wet n Wild one. Uh, it is pretty darn comparable to Tarte Shape Tape. Is it a complete dupe? No. But I'd say it's the closest I've had so far. The Ulta one is pretty close too, not going to lie. Um, but I'm loving it. And then they also talk you about using this to contour. I might go get a different shade to see if I could use it as a contour, because let's face facts, when I get done with my Milk Bronzing Stick, I'm not buying, those suckers are way too expensive. I'm not gonna, I, well, I don't know, never say never. I don't think I'm gonna buy another one of those. So, if I can find a cheaper option, it'd be great. Okay, skincare. Um, I broke down and did it. My under eye lines were getting so bad I started freaking out about it. So I went and got the Foreo Eye. Now all it does is a little tapping motion. Tap, 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 tap. But it has microcurrents and blah, blah, blah. And I'm liking it. Uh, I swear I see a difference after I do it. I swear it lifts this area a little more. My family, it's like genetic. We get droopy eyes so bad when we're older that everyone has to get eye lift surgery. So I'm trying to prevent that. So you use it up here too to kind of tighten those muscles. I'm already seeing a difference. I took a picture on day one. 30 days in, I'll do another picture and I'll do a review, a full review at that point so we can see if there's a difference. But I just want you to know as of now, I'm really liking it. Okay, last two makeup things. These are two pretty current favorites. If you saw my Create and Cultivate video, you saw that I got this brush, this wet brush that's supposed to help dry. Now I haven't used it for drying, but I did comb my hair wet with this uh, and it works great. It works way better than that brush that's called the wet brush. If you've seen it, it's sold at both Target and Urban Outfitters. It looks, it fits in your hand and you do that. That sucker tangles, pulls my hair. I feel like I lose more hair with it. This was great. I will keep using this. So this is from Eco Tools. Um, I'll put a link to it below. You should be able to get it at Target. I don't know. It turns out a bunch of those products from Create and Cultivate are brand new. So like not all of them are even out yet or going to be out this month. So I will try and find it online and put it there for you or once it comes out. But just be on the lookout for this guy. Um, super, super good. And then I mentioned it in another video. I finally started trying my no, bli <laughs> no blow dry MBD uh, airy cream for fine hair for Redken. So this is you wash it and then you just put it in your hair and go. Works pretty darn well. Um, I'm out of all the no blow dry creams I've tried. This is my favorite so far. So I got this at Ulta when it came out. They did like a real deep discount on it. It was $10 instead of $20 or $24 or something like that. Uh, but I would say it's worth the full price. So I liked this. Highly recommend it. It's doing good things for my hair. Okay. Other things that are just favorites this month. One is really heavy. Really, really heavy. All right. So first off, I'm sure you've seen it. These are Universal Thread from Target. These jeans that I can't get in the shop. Universal Thread from Target. It's that new line at Target. I needed jeans. I went and tried them on. They're great. I love the way they fit. I love the way they feel. And they're sized super big. So when you go try them, go down a size. You may be able to go down two sizes. So you also just to get to feel like super good about yourself. Um, so love the new Universal Thread jeans. I think everyone should go get them. I like them as much as my Page and my J brands. Okay, so buy jeans. Last two things. This one's kind of silly. Um, this is from a store called Typo. It's really like a stationary store and it looks like a store that only uh, high school and junior high girls would go in. But I got this eye mask for Christmas. It was in my stocking. Uh, 
and that's so cute it's cute but here's the thing it really works like this is the best eye mask I own and guys I have real sleep issues real like I have chronic insomnia um it's super foamy and so it's very light on your eye the band is just stretchy enough that it's not tugging on your head but it's not so loose that it falls off I've had both of those issues before so on top of being super cute it's just a great mask it works uh, so I suggest going to typo and getting one of their eye masks now the last thing because I am a horrible sleeper I have asked for a weighted blanket uh, I asked just requested it for some sort of gift so for Valentine's Day because yes Yes, my parents, 30s, my parents still give me gifts for Valentine's Day. Uh, they got me a weighted blanket. Now look at it. It's beautiful. Weighted blankets have come up in the world. In case you don't know, it's like velvet. It's so soft and so wonderful and it's heavy. In case you don't know, weighted blankets were first used a lot, to my understanding, for people with autism for children with autism to help calm them down but they realized it's helping people with anxiety that weight on them makes them feel less anxious and so they've realized too it helps people who have sleep disorders this one is from a company called dreamhug dreamhug.co i will put it below this is life-changing i will let you know weighted blankets are expensive um but they are worth every penny this has been game changing I'm trying to like <gasps> throw it back on the bed it has been game changing in my sleep um so I think everyone should get one plus they're finally cute for a while you could go look for a way to blanket and they were all kind of like tacky looking but now there's a couple of companies that are making really nice ones um and it's super nice and it feels wonderful and it's heavy enough you do need to read up on like what's what weight you should get because it's different for children versus adults etc um so read up on that but it totally works it's changed the game for me so highly recommend that and with that we are done for today uh so thank you so much for watching like i said before be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it please leave me a comment of what you liked this month uh what your favorite was yes I'm like oh my gosh am I doing a favor <laughs> please leave a comment of what your favorites were this month in the uh, comment section below and share this video with your friends thank you so much for watching right now you should be getting suggestions of other videos I think you'd like so please keep watching and I will see you in the next one bye